most of the people who go on a weight loss journey gets this whole weight loss funda wrong they think that they lost weight and they became healthy we say the sequence is actually the other way around you became healthy and hence you lost weight that's how you should be looking at it that's what we're going to talk about today my name is rajiv ambat the ceo and the chief health officer at nuvo vivo center for obesity lifestyle disorders and research we are an online health and wellness company working with our clients across the globe help them manage and even reverse lifestyle diseases such as diabetes cholesterol thyroid pcod fatty liver uric acid hypertension irritable bowel syndrome all these lifestyle disorders most of them are also known by another name metabolic disorders why is it called a metabolic disorder because in some way or other it impairs one part of metabolism or some something related to metabolism is broken in simple terms uh, diabetes is where the carbohydrate metabolism does not happen the right way carbohydrate gets metabolized carbohydrates get converted into glucose and is released to blood uptake of that glucose from the blood by the body is not happening because the body is becoming insulin resistant right so in that way it is a metabolic disorder so that's how metabolic disorders are so when you need to become healthy or lose weight or whatever you should really look at about it from improving the metabolism perspective haven't you heard people say that oh that person's metabolism is so good that uh, whatever that he or she eats he does not put on weight i've heard others say that oh my metabolism is so damaged that even if i drink water i'll gain weight and and we have seen people who eats a lot eats like a pig and still well within shape we have also seen people who are eating very little but still overweight or sometimes even obese so really it is a metabolism that we're talking about right and that should be our final goal too so we need to improve metabolism and if we improve metabolism obviously your blood parameters and everything would become normal your hba1c or the three month blood sugar levels would come to the normal levels your cholesterol levels both your triglycerides ldl hdl all these things also would settle down to normal levels your fatty infiltration of liver or fatty deposition on the liver that will come down liver function will improve and in certain cases thyroid is a little more complicated to manage but even that hypothyroidism is categorized by low metabolic uh, parameters so most of these lifestyle disorders has a direct correlation towards metabolism so when you work on improving your metabolism and when your metabolic energy spend of your body is higher you will naturally lose weight and such a weight loss will be more of a fat loss without losing muscles so the result will be that if you lose 10 kg you will actually look you will actually look 10 years younger haven't you seen people who lost 10 kg but actually looks older they uh, have, their skin becomes wrinkled their eyes go inside and they feel very weak and tired all the time and not just that they are actually gain back everything that they lost at a much higher speed and it's difficult to lose that weight again for the second time whereas if you lose weight by improving metabolism and look at weight loss just as a by product of improved metabolism your body is now able to churn up a lot more of food and use up those calories because your metabolic parameters and energy spent by your body is higher in such a case you will look younger you will feel more alert, energetic you will be able to do more uh, uh, exercises or more physically strenuous tasks and you would still feel fresh like a cucumber and that's what an improved metabolism is so when you look at improving health or weight loss because god forbid if a person catches a chronic disease such as cancer or even corona virus the person will lose weight right has the person become healthy absolutely not right so next time when you think about becoming healthy or weight loss understand the sequence is that you improved metabolism which led to improved health and weight loss is just one among the many other results of an improved metabolism now how do you improve metabolism what is metabolism all about we have already done a video about that the link of that video is there in the uh, description um, section of this video i hope you would watch that video as well um if you have any questions or queries or anything to ask please don't hesitate do ask us uh, in the comment section here we are more than happy to answer them um uh, that's it uh, this is rajiv ambat signing off i hope you all are keeping uh, safe and staying healthy staying happy staying fit and staying young take care bye